Here are five exciting Coronation Street spoilers for next week, including an attack, a long lost family search, and a concerning meetup. You don't want to miss out. Spoiler 1 Nathan gets attacked. Bethany overhears Dee Dee's conversation with Carla and Nina regarding Lauren's phone messages. She then sneaks into Dee Dee's office and reads the file on Lauren's case. Bethany soon asks Craig questions about Nathan's alibi, with Craig revealing that Nathan was with his girlfriend who works at a nail bar. Bethany soon fears that Nathan might be grooming just like how he groomed her when running the tanning salon. Nathan spots Bethany outside and confronts her over causing trouble for his girlfriend. Later on, David, Sarah and Gary all fear that Nathan will ruin Bethany's life once more. After this conversation, a hooded figure approaches Nathan and attacks him. Bethany soon becomes obsessed with finding out who attacked Nathan, while Shana becomes suspicious of a stain on David's jeans. She soon sees the tracking app on his phone, confirming that he was at the building site when Nathan was attacked, and confronts him. David promises that he didn't attack Nathan, but admits that he did see it happen. Bethany then starts pointing the finger at Daniel. But who really attacked Nathan? Spoiler 2! George gives Glenda a peace offering. Serving Glenda an apology, George gives her a cheque for 22 grand as a compromise. Will Glenda take it though? Spoiler 3! Bernie tries to track down her son. With Gemma and Deb suspicious of Bernie, Deb finally gets her to admit that she had a son called Zodiac, nicknamed Zach, who she put into care. He was then adopted and changed his name to Christopher Green. Hoping to track her son down, Bernie comes to a dead end when she realises that the last person with the same name as her son on her list died of cancer. But is this Bernie's son? Or is he still out there? Someone may be in danger in our next spoiler, so stick around to find out who it could be. Spoiler 4. Toya has concerns for Leanne's safety. Toya does some research into the Institute and finds a worrying post that is later taken down. Leanne follows up the post in a discussion with Rowan, but he tells her that his ex wrote the comments. Rowan then promises Leanne a tour of the Institute after sharing the news of his promotion with her. Toya becomes even more concerned for her sister's well-being, though when a guy called Jared from the Institute offers to invest in Simon's business. Finding a contact number online, Toya then meets up with Rowan's ex, Una, as she asks for information on the Institute. She explains that her sister is involved and could be at risk. Later on, Leanne packs her bags whilst preparing to head on a retreat, but Toya makes her concerns known. With Leanne leaving without saying goodbye to Simon, Simon goes out and gets drunk before failing to pay for his cab ride from Tim. And finally, spoiler 5, Kevin makes a discovery. Max asks Kevin Abbey for £1,000 in return for the design work on the garage website. Kev doesn't want to give up that amount of cash though. He later searches the Weathy County page and makes a frustrating discovery. What rattled Kev's cage? And if you like this week's Coronation Street spoilers, subscribe so you can come back next week for more gossip from the cobbles.